Now we start to work on the meat and potatoes of our planning. So in this section, we're going to be talking about how do we plan for five, three, one-year goals. Okay. So as the chart says here, and as I said in the earlier videos, we've got to be thinking big. But as we start to think big in those five years, where are we? Where are we going to be? So in this segment, we're going to be looking at where am I going to be in five years? And where is my business going to be in five years? So in this segment, I want you to start writing down where you're going to be and where the business and you as an individual, are you growing? What are you going to grow? How are you going to grow? How are you going to grow as a leader? What does that leader look like? Where are, what is your position in the company? Are you still going to be the manager? Are you going to be the CEO? Are you going to be the owner? Yes, each one of those is different. So what do you need to do as you're going to grow? What do you need to do? Who do you need to be to be that owner, leader, etc.? That's on you personally. Then where is your business? What is your business going to be? It's going to be a $100 million business. It's going to have 70 different branches, et cetera, et cetera. So what does that look like? Okay, this is where you write it down. Then we get down to the three-year goals. So what does that look like in three years? So you've now done your five. What does the three look like? So a little bit smaller, but you're on that trajectory. You're on that path of growth. And then finally, in the next section, we start to look at what does it look like next year? What is it going to be in that one year time frame? So you're going to start looking at what am I going to be by the end of 2022? Now, what I do with my clients is I look at the five, we look at the three, we look at the one, and then we work backwards. So we go one, three, five, because sometimes what we do is we actually set big hairy goals out here, which is awesome. Then you set the mid goal three and then the one. But when you look at the numbers, are you truly making those jumps or did you make a small jump and then a massive jump? So let's be realistic. We've got to have one, three, and five, and they've got to collate as we move forward. We're growing. We're growing through this pattern. In this section, this is what I want you to do. I want you to think of those big hairy goals. Where do you need to be? Then scale it back into three and then scale it down again into what are you going to do next year in 2022? Again, business goals and personal goals, just as important. Five, three, one, one, three, five. Got it? Have fun with it.